Welcome to the tech zone, we on our tech flow And it's still a global market in case you didn't know So many guests we not trying to impress Just wanna pass off the info, you can do the rest See there's no escaping tech, it's part of our lives Keep every individual connected worldwide But all this innovation is more than entertainment It's people like you paving a new way every day So let your imagination run wild With all the things that you dream about Cause the tech zone is on now with Paul Amadeus Lane. Blah. Come and take a journey with me as we go through the land of technology. You'll never be alone. You'll be with Paul Amadeus Lane in the tech zone. Hello and welcome to this edition of the tech zone. I am Paul Amadeus Lane. Spring is almost in the air. The allergies are in the air. Are you like me? Are these allergies like whooping your behind? I know. I know mine is. What's going on? So I, I promise I am going to plow through this episode because we got so much information to consider and to talk about on this edition of the show. We are going to dedicate the entire show to VR, virtual reality. How many of you remember that song by uh, Jamiroquai? Virtual insanity. I love that song. So it always puts virtual reality, you know, in my mind when I hear that. But hey, remember, you can always connect with me, Paul AmadeusLane.com. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Follow me on all the social media platforms. Reach out to me, and uh, we'll have a golly whopping, bebopping good time. That's what we will do. So, what's up? What you guys been up to? Me, you know, I've just been trying to stay out of the wind and uh, not let these allergies take me away. You know what was funny on a last show when I used Google to help me pronounce the word giblets. And when I was growing up, we used to pronounce it giblets, but it was actually giblets. So it helped me with my pronunciation. You should use that uh, sometimes. I want to talk to you for a brief moment about a email scam that's going around. Maybe you have gotten an email saying that they have some compromising information about you. They got your password and they're going to send some compromising um, information to your friends and family. Don't delete this message, yada, yada, yada. Uh, apparently, that's a pretty well uh, effective um, scam out there, especially for for those who visit these adult uh, sites. And they're trying to blackmail you, trying to ransomware, you know, trying to get some money out of you. They tell you to send send money to a, a bit bitcoin account now i got one of these the other day and i do not visit i do not visit adult sites that that's not my thing i don't do that and many of you out there don't do that as well so what do you do when you get a message that says that that i'm going to send some compromising information about uh, you to your friends and family about this what you do is just ignore it. Don't respond to it. Don't send them any money via Bitcoin. And I'm actually going to do a YouTube on this and, and, and share the, the email that was sent to me. But just be careful. And the one thing about Gmail, Gmail is pretty cool with this. It went directly into my spam. So what they're banking on is sending out this blanket um message to people who they think visit or you know who visit porn sites and and a lot of people don't do that but some of you who do beware because <laughs> you might get that email and you might be scared so what are some things you want to do don't visit those sites i mean if you decide to do that you have free will you can do whatever you want to do but just keep in mind Somebody might say they have something on you and they don't, but you're so scared thinking that they do, you have to come out of the pocket. So, service announcement of the day, don't go to those sites. (laughs) 
the other service announcement, if you get an email saying that they got some compromising information on you because you went to these sites and you know for a certainty that you don't go to those sites, don't respond to that email. Even if you do go to those sites, don't respond to that email. It's spam, it's spoofing, and they're trying to get some ducats from you. That's all they're trying to do. All right, so I did my bit for King and Country in this uh, first segment of the show. When we get back, we're going to talk about virtual reality and what some of our friends at Verizon Media are doing when it comes to this subject. So we'll be right back after these messages on the Tech Zone of Paul Amadeus Lane, ABC News Radio K Met. In this world of technology, things are ever changing, rearranging. You need someone to help you out. I know someone who can. Come and take a journey with me as we go through the land of technology. You'll never be alone. You'll be with Paul Amadeus Lane in the tech zone. 